got some answers now on how a 10 year old girl reported missing from Golden and Aurora was found. Investigators say that Madeline Malloy snuck into the car of a family friend last night. The driver then drove to Aurora, and that's when Madeline snuck out. Her family reported her missing last night in Golden, and when they found her, she was 27 miles away. Jamie Leary joins us live now in Golden tonight. And Jamie, you talked to the women who helped Madeline this morning, and they were actually the ones who called police. Yes, that's a true, and it's incredible because Madeline Malloy went unnoticed for hours, and she only went for help when she got cold, but it wasn't to police. Fortunately, though, she ended up knocking on the right door. It was just after 11 last night when Joyce Russell heard a knock at her door. And the little girl asked, uh, can I borrow a blanket? I was actually just thinking that she was one of the kids from down here in the corner. Until that little girl rounded the corner and disappeared. I said, she actually needed that blanket. Joyce set out with her daughter to look for the girl, but had no luck. That's when they saw Madeline Malloy's picture across their TV. We were like, oh my God, that's her. That is her. Joyce called 911 and searched with police until after 2 a.m. They told her they'd keep looking, but... They didn't find her. She actually found us. Around 6.30 this morning, Joyce got another knock on her door. I opened the door, and all I could say was, oh, my God. Ten-year-old Madeline Malloy was once again standing before her. I was like, are you hungry? Do you need something to eat? Are you cold? <laughs> and she said yes. Joyce is no stranger to caring for children. There are four generations of her family under this roof. My daughter made her two pancakes and gave her a glass of milk. Joyce wondered what led her to run away. Police said she had had a fight with her parents. Do you have any home problems? She just said, I'm always getting fussed up for no reason. She was just glad Madeline was alive and well. I could imagine what that parent was going through. The search effort was just incredible. More than 200 people from 17 different agencies came together to help find little Madeline. Live in Golden, Jamie Leary covering Colorado first. Jamie, thank you.